I think by now people have begun to realize that the system is rigged and it is rigged against you. This is not a conspiracy. This is from my experience as a business coach and consultant with 26 years in the industry. What do I mean? I mean that as a society, we are told that the thing we should do is to get a good education, go to university, get a good job and basically work for the rest of our lives. And now there is absolutely no hate to anybody that is doing this. I myself did this until it made me so physically sick that I had to leave, which is exactly how I ended up but doing this. But the point I want to make here, most people want to live a life of their dreams, which means that you need to have a consistent, sustainable income. And that's one that is not trading your time for money, which unfortunately a job will do. But here's the kicker. A lot of people that go into setting up their own businesses end up trading a job with someone else for a job for themselves. And this usually comes because most people who leave a nine to five and set up on their own follow the same parameters that they did in their nine to five job. So they trade time for money because that's what they know. And unfortunately, most small businesses fail in the first five years. And one of those issues is cash flow. And the hard truth is, if you trade your time for money, you only have so much cash flow coming in because there's only so many hours in the day and there's only so much day rate you can charge for your services and your skills before no one's gonna pay it. Or you need to be doing something to make yourself stand out dramatically versus your competition, which can take time. It's doable, but it takes time. So the reality is most people will leave a nine to five, they'll start their own business and they will turn their wheels, they'll trade time for money and then they'll hate their business and they won't generate the income they went into business to do. Now, I don't say this to scare you. I say this uh, for a reality check for a lot of people because I see this happen so many times in my business with my clients. They come to me in a state of distress because they are shocked at how hard it can be. And even though most small businesses fail in the first five years, the irony is that all you actually need to stop your business from failing is a strategy. It is so painfully simple. And it's, one, and it's one of the reasons why I focus heavily on a strategy for anybody coming into my world. But here is the thing. Despite the rigging of the system, owning your own business and running that business like a business and not a side hustle is still the most effective way to create true financial freedom. But it takes work. And it takes a level of being serious about what you were doing with yourself, with your time and your business. If you have any questions,